If you're looking for more file storage for you and your family, look no further than this guy. This is the Ugreen Network Attached Storage Device, or NAS. And it allows you to hold a ridiculous amount of file storage, up to 136 terabytes. And you can pretty much store any kind of file you can think of, so you can store photos, media, backups, and anything else. And what's really cool is, is you can access all of your files from a plethora of different devices, including your tablet, tablets, smartphones, PCs, or Macs. Hey everyone, Tech Dad here, and today's video is sponsored by Ugreen, and they have provided this network attached storage, or NAS, for me to review and demo for you all. And if you don't know what a NAS is, it's basically like having a cloud storage solution right in your own house. So you just hook this guy up to your local network, and then anyone who is on that network can get access to those files at lightning fast speeds. In fact, it's so fast, it's like having the hard drives connected directly into your device. Device. It's crazy how fast it is. And so in this video, I'll give you a full rundown on how to set up this NAS, how to install the hard drives, and I'll show you how to download and use the app both on my M4 iPad Pro and on my iPhone. All right. Let's get into it. All right, so to get started, the first thing you have to do is install the hard drives, and Ugreen has provided four four terabyte drives for the sake of this demo. And so there are four separate bays, as you can see here, and there are also two spots underneath this where you can install solid state drives. Now, there's a pretty handy manual that comes with the device, and it's easy to understand. And so you can just press a button here to undo a bay, and it pops right out. And there's a button on the back here that you can press, and it unlocks this little casing just slightly so that you can fit the drive into the bay dock. There are little notches right here so you can just lock it into the side of the hard drive. You can see there are spots right here that those little notches go into. Once you have your drive in the bay dock, you can just slide it back into the bay and it automatically locks into place. So again, installing the drives is really easy and Ugreen offers a whole list of compatible drives that you can install in this device. And what's cool is this NAS is actually compatible with third-party HDDs and SSDs. So it's nice that you can pick the hard drive of your choice. I'll leave a link in the description below for that list of compatible hard drives. You can check that out. Okay, once you have the hard drives installed, it's time to connect to your local network. And so my router is actually in my son's room above his bed. So for the sake of this demo, you're going to see this NAS on top of his bed. And so you need to connect the NAS to your local network through your router. And they do provide some Ethernet cables, although they are a little short, which is why this NAS got stuck on his bed. I'm sure I can buy a long longer ethernet cable and it'll work just fine. So once you plug into the router, you can then plug the device into power and turn the device on. And there are some indicator lights that show that your device is on and running, that it's connected to the LAN network. And it shows lights where you have an installed hard drive that is functioning. So you can see in here, I've got a hard drive in bay four. And that's pretty much it for setup. You get those hard drives installed, you get connected to the network and you turn the thing on. At that point, you're ready to install the app. And I'm gonna demo this with my M4 iPad Pro as well as my iPhone 16 Pro Max. But you can really access your files from any device you want, PCs, Macs, tablets, phones, whatever. Okay, so you can find the Ugreen NAS app in the App Store. I found this on my iPad very quickly. It's very obvious, and even the app looks like the NAS itself, so pretty simple. Once you install the app, it's gonna run you through some setup processes, including creating an account and even naming your NAS. The setup process is pretty straightforward, and once you're all set up, you're ready to start moving files. So you can upload files very easily as soon as you create a folder. So I created a folder within the NAS and then I can just select directly from my iPad from the files app and start uploading. And the NAS app does a great job to show my progress on each one of those uploads. And it's ridiculously fast. I was really happy with how much I could upload in such a short amount of time. So for me in my use case, having a lot of storage is really helpful because I make a lot of YouTube videos and they are huge, especially when you film in 4K at 60 frames per second. So currently I've been storing everything in my iCloud storage. Well, that's $10 a month. So this NAS pretty much solves that problem. So now I can move all of my video files over to my NAS and it's quick and easy to access them. And I was actually shocked at how fast this thing is. So you can reach a speed of 1250 megabits per second, which is insane. So just to give you an example, I uploaded about 25 gigs worth of video in under two minutes. A lot of times if I wanna upload a video video to Google Drive, it'll take anywhere from five to 15 minutes to just do one video that's about two to three gigs. And viewing those files is rocket fast. It's like you have the drive plugged directly into your device. It's that quick.
quick. So as soon as I tapped a file to view on my iPad, it instantly came up. There's no lag time, they look great. I was really impressed. In addition, I was able to access the exact same files on my phone. I downloaded the same app for iPhone and I could pull up my video files quickly and easily. It was actually really impressive. Now, in addition, Ugreen supplies all kinds of other apps that you can install within the NAS app. For example, there's a photo application where you can back up all of your photos that are on your iPhone. I really loved this. It was simple to just download it and then toggle it on. And now I have a full backup of all my photos. So having this NAS is probably going to remove the need for an iCloud subscription. In addition to backing up all your photos and videos, there is some AI built into this photo app within the NAS. So it'll sort your photos by person or by location of where you've taken them. So for example, I can see the photos and videos that I took in Arizona as opposed to Hawaii. I think that AI is pretty cool. All right, so that's my rundown on the Ugreen NAS system. I think it's pretty darn cool and it does exactly as it advertises. It stores a ridiculous amount of files that you get quick and easy access to on your network. If you want to know more about this product, check out the description below. I'll have a link to it and I'll have a code for 15% off this device if you purchase. Let me know if you have questions about this device in the comments below. I'll take a look at those. That's all I got for you. If you like this sort of content, please like and subscribe and we'll see you next time.